Ivan in Croatia writes to me and he says, hey Paul, what do you think of an active bass trap? Are they really that efficient at killing boomy bass in a room? All right, well, they're not very common. So let's talk about it. I'm gonna assume nobody knows, what. <laughs> obviously he does, but what is an active bass trap? So years ago, my friend Nelson Pass built one of them and he called it, I think it was the, the shadow um, or the phantom or something like that. I don't know. But it was a, a tubular column, probably stood about that tall, and it was basically a subwoofer with a microphone. Okay? And what you do is you set that somewhere in a room where you have a lot of bass or too much bass, and the microphone picks up what is around it, what it hears, flips that out of phase, and produces an out of phase woofer signal. Okay? So we know that anytime we have opposing phases where one is rising up and the other is rising down in sync, they cancel each other out. It's very effective. If, if you doubt the effectivity of it, the effectiveness of it, uh, pick up a copy of the Audiophiles Guide. And on that, I have a, a track on there where you can hear Chris Brunhaver, our speaker designer who designed these beautiful FR30s. And he's playing the stand-up bass, and he boom, 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 boom. Then we do an out-of-phase one. And most people are like, whoa, no idea. You play it in here with a properly set up system, and that is just, whoop, just gone. It stretches way out to the sides. There ain't nothing in the center, and that bass is gone. So active cancellation of bass with a separate unit, an active bass trap, is very effective. The problem is, and the reason I think people don't use it so much, is because even though you affect it in one area, it doesn't take it out of the whole room. I don't know of any product that could take it out of the whole room. So to really be effective, you'd have to have it somewhere near you, and I'm not sure you want this big old thing next to you. So while I think it's a good idea, and it's it, it certainly... I mean, okay, I want to be, I want to be positive, like our, our financial controller, Keenan. Let's say positive things, and, and I admire and love Keenan for it. If you were to set the active bass trap in corners where we have a lot of buildup of bass, it could be very effective. It absolutely could be very effective because that gets rid of that, just like putting in a big trap that's effective for the whole room. So yeah, I'll take it back. It could be effective. Is it perfect? No, well, we don't deal in perfection out here. <laughs> but it could be very effective, sure. Okay, there you go. Thanks for the question. I'll talk to you later.